Do you have an iPhone? <laughs> yeah, me too. And until last week, I thought absolutely everybody knew about the iPhone spacebar hack. But it turns out, I was wrong. Now, I wasn't gonna make this video at first because I thought everybody knew about this already. In fact, back in November of 2018, the internet practically blew up when Chrissy made this post on Twitter. But as it turns out, perhaps a lot of people still don't know about this. So I conducted a little experiment. I would ask 10 different people from 10 different geographical areas and 10 different walks of life if they'd ever heard of the iPhone spacebar hack. Now, the 10th person I asked was my friend Helen on LinkedIn, and she was one of the people who hadn't heard of it. So after talking with Helen, I decided I'd make this video. Now, if you're ever typing more than a couple of words on your iPhone, and it doesn't matter if it's an iMessage or Slack or WhatsApp, when you have to make a correction and you're sitting there like an idiot, jamming your finger into your phone, trying to get the cursor between the two letters that you're hoping for, it becomes extremely frustrating. And let me tell you, there's a better way. And here is how you do it. Hold the spacebar in and move your thumb to the left, right, up, or down and your cursor will move like a mouse does on a computer. Now this is a huge time saver and I use it every day, especially when working with social media apps on my phone. Did you know about the iPhone spacebar hack? Or do you have any helpful iPhone tips that could help other users? Let me know in the comments below.